Say hello to Reptile Head Man, named Kaiman. He has no recollection of memories. That's not the only weird thing about him. There's a man inside him. This place is called The Hole, where sorcerers come to practice their magic on non-magic users, like low-level NPCs. Use the chapters in this video, all very important and are interlinked with each other. I'm going to go over characters, devils, what are they, how do they work, devil tumor, Nakaido's past, Kaiman's true identity, Doridora's main antagonist, and the ending explained. Characters Kaiman, lizard head, amnesia, can't remember anything from his past, works part time at the hospital. Nakaido, muscle mommy, found Kaiman in a body bag, they became friends, she has a secret, she is a sorcerer but decides to hide it and live in whole. Her power is unknown for a long time in the manga, owns a gyoza restaurant called The Hungry Bug. The N Family Located in the magic user world, extremely strong group of sorcerers, mafia-like system, their income comes from selling various goods. N Turns people into mushrooms, strongest member by far, in search for a magic user that can control time. Biographic movie made by N himself gives us his past. I had probably transformed my parents into mushrooms. N was taken and enslaved, forced to work at a factory, using the slaves black smoke for profit. Magic users have organs that allow them to pump magical smoke through most commonly their hands. Their smoke allows them to manifest a unique ability. N runs out of smoke while in the factory and now being useless to them gets dumped into a river. A flying devil spots him, retrieve N's body and put it in a bin that goes straight to Hull. Instead of being consumed by the Hull fire during his descent, his fury allows him to persevere. Impressed by his tenacity, the devils return him. N builds his own empire, targets the factory that treated him so horribly, turning all the staff into mushrooms, destroying the whole factory, freeing the other captive magic users. The captives, grateful and looking for guidance, found refuge under N becoming his followers. Here are important characters of the N family. Kukuragi, chimeric creature that can reanimate the dead, but she's basically N's dog that is super helpful. Shin, heart mask, weapon is a hammer, power is slicing up anything, living things stay alive when sliced up. Noi, muscle mommy, Shin's partner, power is healing, which becomes the most overused power in this manga. Ibetsu, skull mask, mutagenic power that transforms people into lizards or lizard-like creatures. Fujita loses his partner in chapter 1 thanks to Kaiman killing his partner Matsumura. Later on becomes Ibitsu's partner. Destructive magic basically just point like Freezer. Turkey creates identical dolls of people that goes and help find people of interest. Trotter, a weirdo that is madly in love with N. The spelling magic under his mask he is disfigured badly thanks to a special surgery he was subjected to in order to be able to produce smoke from his mouth as well as his hand. Show. Make anything transparent. Funniest introduction in the whole series. Just goes out of invincibility? Out of nowhere? Nobody even remembers him. N even struggled to recall who he was, even though he is currently the longest serving N family member. Tenjin. The first member that was killed by the Cross Eyes boss. This action caught the eyes of N, putting Cross Eyes on his radar. Cross Eyes. With an unknown boss that I will reveal to you later, is a criminal organization in the magic user world. The enemy of the N family. Fashioning crosses around their eyes, they profit on producing and selling black powder, an addictive drug enhancing magic user powers. Here are some important members. The Kuga, with the boss missing for a long time, the Kuga becomes the Cross Eyes boss. Poisonous saliva magic as a result of being tested on. Retsu, unknown magic, looks so much cooler in the manga compared to the anime. Very important character. Titsujo, katana yielding samurai. Ushishimada, ridiculously strong. Ton, not much can bother him, uses throwing knives. Sashi, in charge of money. 
Natsuki becomes newest member, introduced when she mistook Kaiman for a cross-eyed member. She is nice and chilled, she is a magic user, barrier defense. Where Kaiman works at, hospital workers, Vox, a doctor, Professor Kosukabi, obsessed with studying magic users, actually 64 years old, due to the magic done by his wife, married to a devil named Haru. Johnson, a giant cockroach and Kasukabe's assistant. Devils in Doro Hidoro, created at the dawn of time by Chidoruma, is the only born devil, ruler of Hal and the magic user's realm. Every other devil is originally a magic user that undergo a transformation by Chidoruma. Magic users have to take the devil exam. Noi had to wear devil training armor, which is extremely heavy, bat keeping, carry bats up and down devil churches, feed them and clean them. These bats are extremely strong and can easily kill, eat devil meat from dead devils. Last part where Noi failed was smoke abstinence. One year without using smoke aka magic. She failed because she used her healing powers on Shin. We definitely ship them. Once those are done and successful, the magic user will undergo the devil transformation. There are many devils in Dora Hidoro. Most important to remember are Chilaruma, the creator, Haru, married to Kasukabe, magic is aging, age reverting, hence why Kasukabe looks young at 64 years old. Kawajeri is the devil name mostly known as Atsu, adoptive big brother of Nakaido, demoted from being a devil by Chedaruma. Power to teleport anywhere as well as clairvoyance. Gura Gura, Shin's former dog, he was bored and posed as Shin's dog for over 10 years. Moving on to important aspect, Devil Tumor. Located inside the brain, resembling a tiny devil, is the physical representation of a magic user's life force. Devil tumors are the source of the cross-eyes black powder. From the magic user's brain, the cross-eyes boss basically abuses the devil tumor and collects the black powder from it. Nakaido's magic revealed. A lot happens to Nakaido. Captured and forced to be Ain's partner. The reason why Nakaido is because she has magic that involves time. Nakaido was never really a big fan of using magic. She wasn't too sure herself what she could do. Pushing herself to the limit, she discovers that she can spawn a huge fridge-like case. This is a magic time machine box that can completely rewrite history. There is limited amount of uses, so Nakaido needs to choose wisely. She managed to escape En's grasp thanks to Atsu. He changed the appearance of Chota to look like Nakaido. Chota being Chota and obsessing with N doesn't have a problem with this. Chota was incredibly jealous of Nakaido and always wanted to be N's partner. So he goes with the flow. With N not realizing that is a fake Nakaido, she managed to get far away from him as possible and even reunite with Kaiman. Not given a reason to how, Nakaido turns into a devil. Atsu acknowledging that the transformation is extremely fast. Nakaido is a very rare character, limited uses of extreme unique powerful magic. Kaiman's true identity. Time for the massive reveal. The man inside the lizard head. Well, not so fast. You know, Russian dolls. One inside another, inside another, inside another. Kaiman is not one person, but not two. But a total of four plus a curse? Yes, it is confusing. Let's start in order of least confusing chronological of the events. I, Coleman, living in Hole, resented his life. Hated being looked upon as inferior. An easy target for magic users to abuse. The small guy, the ant being squished by passing ongoers, fell into the sludge. This sludge takes over him, possesses him, Crucial details on the sludge later. He was reborn with a split of two people, Aikawa and Kai. Aikawa and Kai shared memories. Everything Aikawa saw or heard, Kai did too. So far, this makes a total of three people. Aikawa usually wears a metal baseball helmet backwards. He is the good version. Goes to magic school with a cross eye member, Ritsu. On the flip side, Kai is evil. He is the founder and boss 
of the cross eyes. You didn't see that coming. Kai would gain more and more power by hunting sorcerers, taking their devil tumors out of them and into himself. Retsu thought he was born without magic. He even attended magic school with Aikawa, no improvement. Believing that if he joins the cross eyes, it will help him some way. He joined them. Retsu tested positive for a very rare kind of curse magic. Aikawa, once knowing this, knew that Retsu would be Kai's new target. Ritsu later gets ambushed by his own group, the Cross Eyes. Ritsu dies but manages for his curse to get to Kai. And that is the answer to who is the man inside the lizard head. The part of why the lizard head is very foggy. Curse, aka Ritsu's magic user persona, which he struggles to control later when he is freed from inside Kaiman and can activate itself when Ritsu is in danger. So Curse manages to tear off his head. While headless, Kai reaches for anything, grabs a bottle of black smoke, aka magic, which he collects to become stronger. This bottle is of Ibitsu's reptile transformation magic, which leads to him having the lizard head. The side effects left him resistant to magic and erased his memories. Who else struggles to remember their past? Kaiman. Quick recap. Kai Coleman wanted to be a sorcerer. Sludge took over him, split personality of Kai evil and Akawa good. Kai wanted Ritsu's magic. Ritsu curse came out, Kai's head off, Ibetsu's bottle of black smoke, Ritsu trapped inside, no memories. Now this is Kaiman. Kaiman is Akawa. But even Kai can still take over Kaiman, just like before with Akawa. Whenever they change between each other, the current head comes off. The new one comes in. Dora Hidora's main antagonist. Even though it would seem like N for more than half of the manga, he has a very soft side while still maintaining to be ruthless when need be. Clearly declared a good guy, saving many and even saving the arch nemesis, the cross eyes. The real villain is Hole. Yes, the town or goes by the name Holy by Chilaruma. This creature came from the now empty lake of refuse on Hole, aka the sludge. The same sludge where I Coleman fell into. Yes, correct, another link. I Coleman is considered as Hole's avatar. This monster wants to kill every magic user. But why? Since the beginning of mankind, magic users came to the city now known as Hole, testing their magic on non-sorcerers. Suffering beyond measure, you can only begin to imagine how much magic was used over time. Rain which falls on the Hole is caused by the residue of magic smoke going up in the sky, causing a thin layer of black dust to accumulate with the falling rain which leads to the sludge. This rain sludge created a manifestation of hatred towards magic users. Ironically, with I Coleman desperately wanting to become a magic user himself, stirred the correct ingredients to create Kai Persona. Important details to know prior. Kai managed to gain extreme power by sucking everyone's power with these pipes. There is probably a rule 34 somewhere about this on the internet. Crazy ending. With the whole entity being at its strongest, reaching a new form and fighting for a while. Kaiman manages to take power, just like Holy can. This person was Nakaira, which her body was taken over, also dropping a very powerful knife, which obtained earlier by Nakaido through her use of her time machine magic. This knife is called the Store's Kitchen Knife. Store is a creature that is not devil nor magic user. This entity resides inside of the store, a butchery located near the gates of Hull. Kaiman swings the knife, slicing at the whole entity and taking his sludge. Chidaruma cheers for Holy because he put a bet on him to win. The bet between Chidaruma and the other devils. Coming out of the giant head is everybody basically. Huge fiasco, not important. They were trapped near wit's end. N family and the cross eyes finally working together. 
to manage to stay alive, the reason for being able to coexist with each other was the realization that the cross-eyed boss never cared about them. So put their differences aside, Shin comes out, uses his slice magic, revealing the whole entity's devil tumor. Another swing of the store knife finally defeats the whole entity. Six months later, they create a giant hole statue, which they use to honor all the dead, the pain and suffering of the abuse on non-sorcerers. Oh, so much earlier, Kaiman gains powers, becoming a gyoza fairy thing. Very goofy indeed. 